Hello everyone, today we'll be learning how to make a Starbound modded server. So what we will need to do first is go onto your Steam profile, go to Library, and click on Tools. And scroll down until you find Starbound Dedicated Server and install it. Once you have done that, go to Properties, Local Files, and Browse Local Files. Once you have done that, you will need to install two more applications, which will be Swell and Penguin. Both will be linked in the description below. Now you want to drag and drop your penguin.exe into your Win64 folder, and your Swell.bat Anyway, in particular, but I'm going to put it in my Starbound dedicated server so it's all nice and cozy. Once you have done that, you need to right click on Swell and press Edit. This is a safe application, so just press Run anyway. Now, these two lines is what we will need to edit. So what we will need to do is from from the window that we have open, click onto your Steam apps, click on your top part, copy and paste, avoiding that you have avoiding that you do not erase anything past the equal sign. Once you have done that, you need to go to your mods folder. So just go back to Starbound server and click on your mods. Copy and paste. And cover on this line. Once you have done that, save the file and exit out. Now your mods might be on the C drive. It should be completely fine. I just have it on a different dedicated drive. Once you have done that, run Swell as an administrator. This is important. Now wait for it to load up. Now what we're going to want to make is create a workshop mod links. So press 1, enter, and it should create the symbolic link process. Then press Q to exit. What this does is it creates a system link, which is basically a shortcut for your computer that links each of your workshop mods into here. This can be also done uh, by put, copying each mods, but this is a good way for just um, putting in workshop mods from the Steam Workshop. You can also put in other mods from forums or wherever you find it. Once you have done that, go to Win64 and press penguin.exe. This is also safe. Once it has loaded, just run it once, and all the mods you have installed will begin to load up. Once your server is ready, just press stop, and this will generate the config file, which we can find here. Now this is where you can type in your server name. I previously have made a server for a YouTube channel called Blow Up. Server motto. And all other files down beneath. The thing that you're probably more interested in is player management. Once you are here, you can type in your type in an account name. This can be any name on <clears throat> from the screen. This will be shown later. But it can type in any name. Let's say 
tutorial, click admin and add a password, which will in this case be passwords. Click add and this will be in the system. And you can just go across and look around and change what you like. Don't forget that you put your port on this number, which will and port forwarding will not be shown on this tutorial. Press start and then hop in game to test when it works. Now while we are in Starbound, which as you can see is more into a fracking universe, go to join game, select a character, and then we'll be using either the port that will be displayed on general info next to server IP or a local host which you can just type in local host lowercase single word or the number right here type in the port and if you have not an admin account or account on the server you can just press join server however if you do have a serve an admin account you will want to type in your name here tutorial and your password and then press join server and you should be able to join your server I hope this was helpful and happy server making